In this lesson, I am refining the nose area. The first thing I want to do is to get rid of this angle line. So let's first duplicate this side. So go to edit, duplicate spatial and put, let me show you from the scratch, reset settings, first reset the settings, then put minus in x scale, scale x to flip that to that side and put this instance on so that whatever I do one side it will reflect to the other side as well so at the same time I'm, I'll do the both side so duplicate special now it's has been duplicated and now we can see it, it's an instance object so if I change something in this on this side so it reflects on that side okay so let's do that in the nodes let's take the cut multi-cut tool and click from here by using this tool i can create a loop manually so i can go switch my direction or i can hit backspace to back go backward and let's continue this line and turn this line here just put an point here in the center then go to this edge then hit enter or right click to complete this line then put one point from here to here to divide this as a quad then from this point bring that is till here and delete delete this edge loop we don't not need that okay. do the same thing here as well so let's take that you can see that last tool is always appears here so you can take that from here multi cut tool again do the same thing click right click and click and this line also help us to create the depression here so just and delete this center edge you can see some of the vertex are crossing each other here and, and there are some gaps here it's because of the center line is not aligned properly so just select all those vertex in the center and just scale those just select carefully you don't have to select in the mid okay how to select properly just scale it in x axis so that it lined up then move turn on the snap to grid option then move to snap all those vertexes to the grid turn up this then duplicate again duplicate special you don't have to put those values here again it's there just duplicate now you can see it's better okay and then the second thing i want to change obviously we should we should slice slide this edge loop a bit okay so just this loop as well just move that a bit and if you see from the front view nose has a beautiful mass here you can see a big spear here so we we are missing that right now we don't have that right now so just just uh, move this area like this and try to create that balls like shape here in the center you can see my reference is not perfect so i can't exactly put those here so sometimes you need to eyeballing some things and you know, 
okay so let's go to the side view and bring this down because if you see the nose from the front you can see this u shape like here so just adjust those bring this down okay better than before let's press 3 to check now you can see the center mass is there and the second thing is to get that crease line the nostril side line now it's very smooth in our model so just put an edge loop or multi use the multi cut tool and just uh, I'm crossing here to this side so I want to create a supporting edge loop there and you can see I put that edge loop close to here but I am spreading that edge loop here because I don't want that line goes all around there and you can see here is a triangle and an insided face in this situation you just need to merge these two vertexes so just merge these two vertices to get rid of that triangle and to make that inside a quad you can see that triangle is gone and the inside it is converted to quad so do the same thing here it's a triangle and it's an inside face so just merge these two vertices most to center and obviously in the mid time you should have phrase or you should adjust all this what is this here? And our depression line is not there, so just push these vertices here and okay, it's you can see the safe diamond shape there. Just try to achieve that diamond angle there okay okay so that's it for this lesson and in the next lesson we are going to create the ear so see you